Hey there on the Slow Cow on a Yom to spiritual journey. When Super Whale, when Super Whale utterly destroyed me. I'm almost expecting today to go the same way. Uh, I'm just gonna keep going here. Once again, I give myself a one hour budget of time. Welcome to Block Room. So, something I've learned yesterday. When the block hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that is love. No. When you are on a block that's stacked on something else, it's like you lose the move along with the block property. And you just kind of end up, like, you, you don't move with it, and it feels real uncomfortable, and I hate it. Basically, that's, that's what I learned yesterday. Whoosh. Whoosh. Alright, a pretty hectic room, but we'll, we'll see how goes. Spike. Yeah, no, see, yeah, there I, I didn't press any arrows and I, I fell to the left of it. Oh, it just always feels terrible. Like, just always. Huh? What's that block mean? Like, what is it? Uh, it might be a spike? Maybe? <laughs> like a falling spike? This is calm. I love this part of the song. I don't like every part of the song equally. I can't stand on the block, my friend. I'm not sure what you want there, honestly. Which is kind of the catchphrase of Bowser's Castle. I don't know what I want. And so I die. Like, maybe that's what you want to do, but better somehow? Keyword here. Somehow. Well, that's not better. Anyhow. So. Alright, the more I'm playing this, the easier it's getting, though. So. It's all good. Well, maybe let's not exaggerate. I wonder if you're meant to walk along with the block you're on so the bomb doesn't fall at all until it's like too late for it to have an impact. Yeah, see, I, I wonder if I can ride the block down. I'll be safe from the thwomp. But the thing is, like, riding the thwomp, the, the block down? Like, that's not easy. <laughs> like, you gotta move at the exact same speed that, uh, that it's bouncing around, and that's not a natural speed for Mario. Like, it is between walking and running speed. See, if I was more on, yeah, on the ride there, the block, I, I might have been okay. It's really hard to walk with a block, I find at the very least. Maybe it's a learned skill, like something you can become good at. Well, yeah, you can become good at anything. <sighs> I can do this. But like, nothing in this level is hard to execute. It's timing, it's precise. Okay, yeah, see there I did a jump instead. Uh. Well, hey, new thing. Whoa, I died instantly. What a shock. But I need to figure out what I did. Like, what I did when I won that part was purely by accident, so the problem is I'm not sure what it is that I did. Okay, so it's just a big chunk of jump. Got it. Oh, I mean, yeah, again, could have been an angel block that goes back and forth. No, it's an angel block that goes just to the left. You won't know till you don't show. See, an angel like that, I mean, that 
It has nothing to do with me missing it though, that was me being bad. How I miss that, I don't know. I really don't. What I do know is that the music loop is around six minute long, so it's... And I remember hearing this part doing this thing, so I haven't done progress in at least six... Look at... No, at least ten minutes, so nothing. Yeah, I think I've discovered a new pet peeve of mine. Blocks that don't bring you with them. That you, like, it's just, it never feels bad. Twelve minutes into this, still feels super garbage. Like, the parts where you bounce on enemies, I love them. You'll notice it's not the majority of this level. Okay. didn't spawn here. I think the first time I got here there was a plump. Well, not anymore. I don't know what I'm saying yet. Okay, again, it's like, REACT! I have reacted. I hope it was to your liking! It's an angel block that does that, so you need to immediately jump the phone. Like, to be fair, I could kind of tell that that's what was going to be asked, so it's my fault for staying there for like half a frame. So, yeah, no, I get it, it's my fault. Like, that is super cool, though. Ah, the chain sale de merde! Alright, so what's happening here? Hot garbage. Got it! Got it! No! Feels great! Feels delicious! Probably super easy to do. Yeah. When you know what to do. Here, I had the audacity again of hesitating for literally not a full second, a fraction of a second. Like, so much, like, it's, a lot of it is so clever, but you can't react to half the things the level throws at you unless you're extremely lucky. Or you know exactly what's gonna happen. I don't know, like, I don't know, bean room, I don't even know what that means. Okay, they're calling that beans, that's fine. Springy thing, skeleton. Don't be spooked. Uh, what? What? Okay, of course. The springy things are attached to spikes. Of course. Naturally. Okay. Nothing can- So, what you're doing here, basically, is you're going bop, then you return here, and then, yeah, so the spike is caught on a 1NH8, so you can do that. There it says B. It really wants me to be. I'm gonna be. Oh, right, because you gotta bounce on this guy here. Here you gotta A. Got it. This is confusing. <laughs> and 
here, you want to go over there. See, this is neat. Ugh. This is saying, man, you know what? The one thing Mario Maker has over Smoo and Smith X is how easy it is to stack things. But then you realize, boy howdy, you can't really do much with that stacking in Sumaru Maker, can't you? Feels almost rude. This is cool. The physics are weird, because I was trying to hop there and somehow I felt like I was super glued to the thing. Maybe. Let's turn that into a yippee. Yeah, see it like I... Oh, boy. Uh, yep, I wasn't on the very edge. It's kind of hard to do. But I mean, here if I die... Well, okay, I need to take this hit, but... Uh. Yeah, like, I just... I... Uh, no! Now we're back in that trap of know exactly what's going to come up forward because you need to be exactly in this one position to be able to make it through. Ugh. Ugh. Hey, all my hits here. Meaningless, but it's still fun. Like, oh, okay, that worked. Nope, that didn't, though! Possible, like, because of the... Go! It's here, I'm in the exact same state. Arkansas. Well, I mean... Well, I'm still alive. What? Okay. Well, hey, I did all that in one shot. I lose my power off because I got a lot of work. Bean room! It's fine. It's fine. There's a learning curve. Alright, let's get utterly eaten alive now. Because that's what the. See, this is cool, but again, like, it's just gonna eat me alive. Alright, I think I see what's going on. I got a second hand surf. Oh, you're carrying poison. That's rude. But you know, you got... Yeah, like, Lava Lotus. Lava Lotus sing it up. Here we got fish. You jump! You don't run anything. Mostly mining its own business. It's too much, man. Ah, he jumps. Well, that's not solid at all! Of course! There's no... I get hit by something. Hey, this is solid. This wall here? It's not a wall wall. I, I, like, I, so many thumbs up that triggered a phobia I didn't even think I had. Like, is this safe? No, he's gonna erupt and then I'm gonna kill it. But there's another mushroom there. Ah, oh, dude. This is no good. He's gonna erupt. It doesn't matter. Okay, this is actually very doable when that happens. Uh, that's, uh, okay. This is a survival room, by the way. That's a dead guy. Ah! I can't play video games! Super fish taking, like, a thousand kilometers. Fish. Alright. Survival. Yeah, that's how we survive here. We just die forever. You think that's the opposite of surviving? Well, okay, but this part has turned real easy over time. Then I just jump in that guy like a complete buffoon. I don't like where my commentary goes sometimes. Uh, but it would be very useful. Well, being here big, that I lose immediately, you know, that's... Ah, ta Why did I wiggle to the side there? Like, what did I gain from doing that? Whoa. Whoa! Okay. Now it's okay if I waste a hit, because I got two of them to waste. I don't know why you moved through me like that, but it was uncalled for. So this is a survive, but 
spawns. Ah, of course the pollen! Of course the pollen! Of course the pollen! Well, so much here. Come jump where it's impossible for a fish to miss me. Like, that's what I'm supposed to do, right? Is I get hit by the fish challenge, I think? When you get hit by enough fish, like, you get, like, points? Okay, so... Oh, great, yeah, right, it's the old football physics everyone loves. That's this game. I'm stuck now in a stupid lot. I'm just gonna die here forever, don't mind me. Alright, stupid pokey head. Stupid... God. Fantastic. Like, is that the issue? I need to look up what not getting hurt implies? I'm starting to think, I just don't know. Hey, something new. Alright. Well, I mean, I got hurt. Tabarnak, seriously? We will play them. Did that to release salad party here. Alright, he's back. Blamer than ever. Hey buddy, I'm here. Oh. That's pretty cool. Alright. That's pretty fun. That's a pretty Wah, he ah, ah. Ah, ah, beep. Hey, football but uh. There's the pollen! There's the pollen there! Whoa! I got hit by a pollen. I don't think that ever happened before. First time in video game. Worth the chivo right there. Where's my little Xbox rumble, man? I got hit by a pollen. There too! I got hit by a second pollen! I think I'm the first human where that ever happened. I thus declare myself emperor of all gamers. No one ever did that. I mean, to be fair, things have been getting a lot more consistent, so, you know, I am learning, I am improving. As much as if you were just to listen to me, like, in the radio play version of this, you'd think I was just messing it up left and right. Well, I am. <laughs> oh, man, like, this hat thing is so cool, but, like, how do you... I think your best bet is to follow him behind and do that. Like, you want to go... Behind whatever's great, great B. <gasps> you destroyed him. Ah, oh, you are my best friend. Oh. I'm press select twice, but you know what? What? I guess I didn't press it right enough. Look, I I have to do the other junction. Like I have to. It's the law. I'm probably yeah. I'm just hit one hour. Don't care. I'm playing still. All right. What's happening here? What are you teaching me here? <laughs> that. Uh, Alright, so, do a little bit of this. You might need to do a full jump. Okay. And it doesn't trigger if it's not on camera. Uh. Alright, I mean, now it's the same idea. Okay, well, I mean, I see what's going on. We'll see how things develop through time. 
So yeah, you kind of just want to bump into them. Because that's the... What am I seeing? Okay. Because that's the slowest the speed can move, and so if it's going slow, you can maybe react. Maybe. I mean, I don't know how it's gonna do. I'm just... I'm an observer. Go here. Okay. So even though you clearly get bisected there, you nonetheless keep sliding around with your new friends. So I wanna do here, then I wanna bounce on it, but if you fall down there, those are all invisible blocks, so you all die. You end up here, and I miss you. I don't... Great. Yeah, you kind of get detached in a weird way. It's... So, what does this mean? Okay, I can grab you. Chuck that in there. And I made it impossible. <laughs> I did it! I figured it out! Alright, so here I have time to look. Because I can pick you... I can pick the whole thing up. Oh, the two coins means I'm supposed to... Okay, I, I think I get it. I didn't do it. Like, the two coins means I think I need to reduce them down to being, like, one pickle. react to things in this level. It's crazy. Yeah. So he's there strictly as a land precision landing engine engine. But no, yeah, like I can react to things. Uh, I can plan things out. Like this part feels great. I don't know why my momentum keeps bringing me here, but I don't care. I'm having fun. I'm legit having legit fun. Even if I die all the time, it's still fun. Self-help should not be a boogeyman. So we'll go here, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right, so that's why the shell is there. It's to make sure you land on that corner and not one block further. Well, it doesn't help if I miss the poke. Oh, if you heard the head, he just grows a new head, right. You really need to hit the body. You know, basic stuff everyone knows about Super Mario World. Almost <laughs> didn't do it. Now the fun part is... Can I hit that? I sure can. Do I want to? Well, I can place you here now. Oh, I think acts like I had to hit that, but make sure that the shell didn't hit my pokey. So I think I might have gotten lucky. I might have, I don't actually know. Well, uh, I got this. I don't know what's happening at all. 
No, I messed it up. I messed it up. I messed it up. It's a fireball. I can't grab it with Yoshi. It's gonna get converted into fire. Yeah, this thing kind of goes. Yeah, those coins mean something. So I got fart power. So I can fart you up here. And, like, over here. And then I can do that. And bounce on top here. Or... I... I don't know. I don't know what it wants there. I guess I could put it all the way on the edge. Like on the block. Could if I want to. I need a cactus or the shell, so I'm just gonna do that. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. You know what? It doesn't matter if I struggled a lot. Cactus from Heaven was a genuine piece of joy. It was actually, I think, it was a bit long, but maybe I'm just tired. <laughs> But, I went over time by Jet, but, like, I had enough fun that I didn't really notice. I don't know if I'm going to finish next time, or if it's gonna take two more. I mean, I, I just flat out don't know. You cannot really predict the difficulty in this thing. But, uh, I... But, uh, 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 but,